السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته محاضرتنا اليوم هي المادة البور سيستم أناليسيز لطلاب الجامعة التكنولوجية قسم هندسة الكهروميكانيك مرحلة رابعة فرع الطاقة والطاقات المتجددة الموضوع هو اللود فلو ستديس راح ناخذ اكزامبل على طريقة نيوتن رافسل ميثود يلقيها على مسامعكم الدكتور غسان عبد الحسين بلا Let's uh, read the example together. The power system of figure below. This is we have a figure below. Each of the three lines has a series impedance. So we have three lines between one and two, between two and three, and three and one. So the impedance is 0.02 plus J.08 per unit. And the total shunt impedance of J.02 per unit. The specified quantities at the buses are tabulated. So we have three buses, one, two, three. So we have these three buses, and this is the information of each bus. So for example, bus number one, you have the power load two and QL one, and the voltage 1.04 to the angle zero, and the, the remark of the bus, slack bus. يعني معناه slack bus هذا. Bus number two, this is the information, and معناه is load bus PQ. Bus number three is a voltage control, which is mean BV. Okay, so controllable reactive power source is available at bus 3. So we have a BV here and bus 3. With constraint Q, G, Q, G between 0 and 1.5 per unit. So using the neutral Raphson method to find the dimension of Jacobian matrix power mismatch, delta B node, <coughs> delta B2 node, delta B3 node, delta Q2 node, and J1, to two, J1, two, three. So we have a neutral Raphson method and we have Gauss series. So we limited you to use the neutral Raphson method. If we didn't tell you which, uh, which method, you have to choose any method that you see it is easy. But if you limited you so that we have to use the neutral Raphson or Gauss series, you have to use this method. Okay? So <clears throat> So we have the number of rows 2NG minus NG minus 2. Okay, so this is the formula. So we have N is the number of pass and NG is the number of pass BV generator. Okay, so 2 multiplied by 3 passes minus 1. We have a generator just 1 at pass 3 minus 2 equal 3. So the number of column, which is the same formula, 2N minus NG minus 2. So the number of pass is a 3, ng is 1, and you get 3. So the dimension of Jacobian matrix, which is 3 by 3. <clears throat> okay, so to start iteration, we choose the voltage at pass to 1 to the angle 0 from equation 27 and 28 from the material that you have. This is two equations. Okay, we have a power and the Q. Okay. So first of all, we need to calculate the delta B2, delta B3, and delta Q. You have to use this formula. So how are we going to calculate delta B2? B2 is satisfied minus B2 calculate. And delta B3, B3 satisfied minus B3 calculate. Delta Q2, delta Q2 satisfied and Q2 calculate. So when I say satisfied, mean that is here. So the B2 here and B3 here. So you're going to... B, B generator and B load, okay? And I'm going to show you how to calculate, okay? <clears throat> so first, we need to calculate the admittance to the mutual. So we have three buses. So the Y21 or Y12 is the same, but the mutual is a minus, okay? So you're going to uh, divide 1 over 0.02 plus J.08, which is this is the impedance. We need to admittance, so we need to say 1 over this Z. So this is the admittance, okay? So Y23, the same, 1 over Z23, and 422, two, which is the uh, self, and you have to add all the admittance is coming from the bus, or out from the bus, okay? And the voltage, we have V1, V2, V3. So the power, the power, you have to use this formula as I mentioned, which is Y21, V2, V1, cosine theta 2, 1, minus delta 2, plus delta 1, plus Y22, V2 squared, and so on, so far. 
So you need to apply this formula in order to get V2. So Y21, you calculate it already V2, we have it, okay, or at uh, initial iteration, and V1 the same, theta 2, you will get it from the admittance, so this is represent theta 2, this is represent theta 2, 3, okay, and the delta is this delta 1, this is delta 2, and this is delta 3, so you have to put all this value in this formula, so you will calculate P2. <clears throat> And for P3, the same. Okay, so what we have to apply P3 on this formula. So from 1, 2, 3, we have this formula. Okay, so this is summation. So Y, I, which is a 3, and the N is going to be changing. So now Y3, 1, V3, V1, cosine 3, 1, minus delta 3, plus delta 1, plus y3 2 v3 v2 cosine 3 2 minus delta uh, 3 plus delta 2 and then plus y y 3 3 okay this is v3 and this is v3 this is square okay cosine 3 3 this is minus delta 3 plus delta 3 is gonna go and you have this part okay so just apply it, which is summation, you will get P3. And then you have to add all the values that you calculated already, admittance, voltages, and theta. This formula, you will get P3. So now we have B2 and P3. For Q2, the same. You have to use this, the same with the B, just the different minus and the sign. So for 2... So the I is 2 and the N is 1. So we have three buses from 1 to 3. So this is repeated three times. So this is first time, this is second time, and this third time. Just apply to the formula, you will get Q2. And you have to apply all these values that you calculate or you will get Q2. Now, delta B2. We need to calculate delta B2. As I mentioned, B2 satisfied from where? From the tables. So there. So BG minus EL, which is 0.5 minus 0, you will get 0.5. So this is B satisfied, okay, which is 0.5 minus B2 calculate. You already calculate this, which is minus 0.23. So minus 0.23 minus minus plus. So you're going to add this. You will get 0.73 bearing this for delta B2. For delta B3, so B3 satisfied. If you go to the table, so this is B3 satisfied. 0 minus 1.5, which is minus 1.5. Okay, which is minus 1.5. Minus B3 that you calculated from here, 0.12. Okay, so you're going to add them together on 1.62 per unit. For delta Q2, which is Q2 satisfied, you're going to go to the table. And then this is Q2. So you have to go QG1 minus 0. So you will get 1. Okay. So this is 1 minus Q2 satisfied that you calculate from here. Put it here. So you're going to add them. You will get 1.96 per unit. So this is delta B2, delta B3, and delta Q2. For Jacobian J222, which is partial B2 over partial delta 2. So you're going to go where? To the B2 here. So you're going to drive this to delta 2. So where is delta 2 here? We have delta 2 on here. We don't have, which is 0 on here. We have delta 2. So for this, this is, is constant. The cosine, like uh, drive for the cosine minus sign okay minus sign this constant minus inside the uh, inside the cosine which is minus one minus minus so is going to be positive okay which is this is positive okay plus plus this is zero plus this is constant and مشتقت is cosine minus sign مشتقت داخل قوس minus one you're going to be get one okay so this is the same now we have to apply all the value that we have, so you will calculate this 24.47. For this, now B22 delta 3. So if we go to the B2, 
drive to delta 3 this is 0 we don't have delta 3 and this is 0 we don't have so just this part so this is constant مشتقه الكوسين minus sign and مشتقه دلت داخل القوس is 1 so it's gonna minus y this minus and this is the constant and this is the sign you have to apply all this value you will get this value if you have any question please let me know thank you so much